Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm back with another top 10 Minecraft mods, this time for version 1.12.1. And if any of these mods stick out to you in particular, you can find them all in the description below. I will include the links for you and a link for Minecraft Forge because you'll need that for pretty much every mod you install. And anyways, let's go ahead and get into the video. At number 10, we have the Klee Slabs mod, and this mod is really more of a bug fix, but it fixes a bug that is really annoying in this game. What it does is it allows you to break either the top or bottom of a slab, so you don't have to try and break the bottom one and it breaks the entire block, and it just saves you from a lot of frustration as you're building. At number 9, we have the Fast Leaf Decay mod, and this mod just makes it so leaves disappear a lot faster after you break the tree down, because it doesn't really make sense to have the leaves floating in the air for like 5 minutes straight, and instead they'll only be there for about 5 seconds. This is just a nice mod because it gets rid of a kind of annoying part of the game. At number 8, we have the Storage Drawers mod, and this mod allows you to insert stacks of blocks into the new drawer blocks, and you can easily access these just by left clicking on the new block, and it'll either give you one block if you just click it, or if you shift click you'll get an entire stack, and it just allows you to sort your items out and keep it organized a lot easier, and it also allows you to access whatever you need much faster. At number 7 we have the Inventory Tweaks mod, and this mod allows you to sort all your chests or your inventory simply by just pressing one button. And this mod is very nice if you can't keep yourself organized when you're playing the game and you just throw all your stuff into chests, and you can quickly just sort everything you have and you don't really have to worry about that part of the game. At number 6 we have the Just Enough Items mod, and this mod allows you to search up the recipes instantly for whatever block you need, and this will work with mods, so if you have a certain mod installed and you need to know how to make something from within it, you can quickly search it up and you will no longer be left without its recipe, and you can also turn on a cheat mode so you can spawn in any item you possibly need if you're into that kind of stuff and this is a very helpful mod for those of you that don't know how to make anything because you have like a hundred mods installed but you really need to know how to make something. At number five we have the item physic mod and this mod makes it so any blocks that you throw out of your inventory will now render on the ground as if you actually dropped something. They won't just sit there and spin in circles because that doesn't make any sense and when you throw the items you can throw them at different powers so they go different distances and it's just a pretty fun mod to play with. At number 4 we have the journey map mod, and this mod adds a new minimap to the top right of your screen that shows you exactly where you are and all the mobs around you and stuff like that, and this mod also allows you to set waypoints so you won't get lost and you can actually find your way back home. And the best feature of this mod is that you can open up a menu that shows everywhere you have been in the world, and it's just really cool to see this map get drawn out as you go because it gets bigger and bigger as time goes by. At number 3 we have the Biomes of Plenty mod, and this mod is very nice to have because before in Minecraft there's only like 15 biomes or something like that, so it gets pretty old fairly quickly. And this mod adds over 70 biomes to the game, so you really will never find all of them, and it's just always something new to explore. So if you enjoy exploring while you are playing Minecraft, this mod is definitely for you. At number 2 we have the World Edit mod, and this mod allows you to massively edit your world as you are playing in creative mode and add giant amounts of new blocks to the game very quickly, and this just makes it so building is much easier and faster, and you can do some really nice stuff with it if you just learn how to use it. And overall, it's probably tied, I'd say, for the best mod because of how useful it is. However, number one is just used probably by more people and isn't as specifically needed for one game mode, so overall that is why this mod is at number two. Finally, at number one, we have the Optifine mod, and I pretty much have this mod as number one in every single new video I make that's a new version, just because of how necessary it is to have when you're playing. And this mod just makes your game run much better, not to mention all of its features such as shaders, dynamic lighting, and overall this is probably in general just the best mod in Minecraft and it's really just a must have. Well guys, that concludes this video. Remember that if any of the mods stick out to you, you can find all of the download links in the description below. And if you think I missed any mods, let me know in the comments down below and in general just your thoughts. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, thanks for watching.